Hi friends, GDPL team, welcome to all of you. In this video, we will discuss about inductive and detective methods, which is important for our exams, especially for RPSC second grade English exam. In this video, we will discuss about advantage and disadvantage of deductive and inductive methods. Uh, so I hope this video will be helpful to crack your exams. If you like this video, don't forget to like our video, share with your friends and to get more updates of our videos don't forget to subscribe our youtube channel gdpl so guys here we are going to start our uh, topic what is the inductive or what is the detective methods or what are advantage or disadvantage let's begin if we talk about uh, uh, the methods then methods of teaching grammars if we talk about the methods of teaching grammar at that moment there are uh, especially four methods of teaching grammar just we can discuss about detective inductive uh, detective methods inductive methods and inductive detective method and incidental methods but in this video we will discuss about detective and inductive methods to be clear guys so we talk about detective methods so uh, the method detective in the detective method the teacher uses a grammar textbook grammar textbook to be clear again i would like to repeat in detective method the teacher uses a grammar textbook he tells his student rules or definitions and explain those with the help of example then he gives extract and asks the people to apply the rules okay so if we talk about uh, the advantage who then advantage of detective method then the first of all average teacher average teacher can teach by using this method average teacher can teach okay and especially this is the beneficial if we talk about the India this is the best form if we talk about the Indian school okay so uh, the first advantage of detective method is average teacher can teach easily to be clear guys and if we talk about in country like India if the second we talk about the learner can try the grammatical questions very easily learner learner can try grammatical questions very easily first of all average teacher can teach easily we talk about the like India and the second learners can try to grammatical questions very easily okay and if we talk about the next advantage of a detective method then learner can respond effectively effectively and explain rules structures etc and if we talk this method helps a student to compare ideas in grammar or mother tongue and second or first language to be clear guys so if we talk about the detective methods then first of all i would like to tell you in detective method teacher uses grammar textbook okay and if we talk about the advantage of detective methods then average teacher can use this method easily or average teacher can uh, teach easily uh, through these methods uh, if we talk uh, or if we uh, like uh, put the example then in India okay and if we talk about then learner can try the grammatical questions very easily and if we talk about the next advantage then learners can respond effectively and can explain rules structure etc but now if we talk about the disadvantage disadvantage of detective method to be clear then we can say 
कम्युनिकेटिव एबिलिटी अमोंग ओ दिस मेथड कैन नॉट डेवलप फर्स्ट दिस मेथड कैन नॉट डेवलप कम्युनिकेटिव एबिलिटी अमंग लर्नर्स टू बी क्लियर गैस द फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल इफ वी टॉक अबाउट द डिसएडवांटेज देन द फर्स्ट इज एडवांटेज इज दिस मेथड कैन नॉट डेवलप कम्युनिकेटिव एबिलिटी अमंग लर्नर्स टू बी क्लियर लर्नर्स बिकेम If we talk about the learners become inactive in this method, and if we talk next disadvantage, then this method is not child centered. Not child centered, but it is teacher centered. to be clear guys the first of all i would like to tell about the disadvantages of a detective method then just we can see this method cannot develop communicative ability among learners and if we talk then learners become inactive during the classroom teachings and this method is not child centered okay but teacher centered in the classroom teaching there is hardly use of od visual aids to be clear guys so there are many disadvantages of detective method okay and now we talk about the inductive method now we talk about the inductive method so that in inductive methods in inductive the teacher first present examples from the students then comes on theory or concept to be clear again here i am going to repeat and you have to learn what is the process if we talk about the inductive method then in inductive method teacher first presents example from the students then comes on theory or concept to be clear guys now if we talk about the advantage advantage okay of inductive method then first of all inductive method is based on the theory from example to generalizations to be clear so this kind of questions frequently asked in the examin examination so first of all inductive method is based on the theory from example to generalizations to be clear so it is very useful in classroom teaching to be clear first of all and second we talk about the advantage of inductive method then learners learn the particular grammar point through use so point number 2 learners learn the particular grammar point through use this is also important point here we are talking about the advantages of inductive method right guys so and if we talk about uh, in the inductive method this method helps student to understand the difference between particular notions in grammar to be clear guys so there are advantages of indu inductive methods and now if we talk about the disadvantage okay Now we talk about the disadvantages of inductive method. To be clear, guys, the first of all, this is not useful in over crowded classroom like in India. So the first disadvantage is it is not useful in over crowded school uh, class chamber like India. So this method is not useful in over crowded classes like India. To be clear, the first disadvantage. of inductive method inductive method to be clear guys and now we talk about the next point that institute must be ready to focus the language except not to the mark criteria and if we talk then only an innovative teacher can use this method so this is also the big uh, challenge because if we talk about the inductive method then the major disadvantage is that only an innovative teacher can use this method so this is also problem the first overcrowded classroom it is not useful in overcrowded classroom and then a second only an innovative teachers can use this method 
and if we talk about the next disadvantage then in this matter the teacher has to use modern method of teaching languages to be clear guys so in this video we talk about the detective and inductive method and what is the deductive method what is the inductive methods and what uh, are the advantages or disadvantages of detective or inductive methods to be clear guys and uh, in the next video we will discuss about the next point i hope this video will be helpful for you so thank you for watching this video